We've already got that pit sweat going. Whew. Pit sweat. When temperatures are high outside, it can be unbearable, but I'm gonna share with you a few ways you can beat the heat. The sun can turn your car into what feels like an oven. Here's how to quickly cool off your car interior. Start with rolling down that passenger window. Once it's rolled down, fan the driver's side door. Just fan the door about eight to 10 times. That'll push all that hot air out of the car. Yeah, it feels good in here. There's a few things you can do to prevent the interior car from getting too hot in the first place. After you park, turn your wheel upside down. That'll keep the top part in the shade. If you can, also crack your windows about an inch. Keep a large towel in your car to cover your seats, console, and dash. And a towel helps to protect your seats if you're extra sweaty. Believe it or not, the air outside is going to be cooler than the air inside. With these tips, now we're ready to drive. I'm in reverse! <laughs> fan is good, but sometimes it's just not enough. I've always wanted to do this. I'm gonna show you how to make your own DIY air conditioner. First, you're gonna need a large container. I insulated two storage bins. Or you can insulate a bucket or a cooler, which is already insulated. To assemble our AC unit, you're gonna need the lid, some PVC pipes, and a fan. First, we're gonna need to trace our cutouts. And it's not perfect, but we just wanna trace the shape of our fan. Now we need to cut these sections out. You don't have to cut the circle completely out. What you're looking for is kind of the shape of the top where you put a straw through a lid. Like a glove. All right, now that everything fits, we need one last thing. For the real AC effect, we need ice. I like to use frozen jugs like this. That way you don't have to pour out water and you could refreeze them and use them again. Here we go, time to fire it up. It worked. Woohoo! To make this more efficient, you could seal up the edges of the fan with tape. And it's also a good tip to use elbow brackets like this so you can position the air where you want it to go. Oh yeah, that feels good. If you've been making ice packs like this, you're doing it wrong. Here's how you make your own gel ice packs. So squishy. Let's start off with a reusable zip top bag. They're more sustainable. Add two parts water, one part alcohol, a little bit of dish soap, for the right look, food color. Now, get as much air out as you can. Just make sure that's sealed tight or you can double bag it. Now this goes into the freezer for a few hours or overnight. After some time in the freezer, we have our gel ice packs. If you want it a little more firm, just add less alcohol. If the heat is getting to you, you don't have to suffer. Here's how to use your pulse points to cool off if you're feeling overheated. Cooling off your pulse points will circulate cool blood throughout your body, giving you some relief. You can hold some ice water against your wrist or run them under cool water. Ice packs also work great against your wrist, the back of your neck, and even your feet. Wrap your ice pack in a towel first, so that way the cold doesn't irritate your skin. Apply the cold for 10 to 20 minutes and see how you feel. Don't forget to drink plenty of water. To cool off, take advantage of those pulse points to feel more comfortable. Hot temperatures call for super cold, refreshing drinks. And maybe a dip in the pool. Just kidding. For the coldest drinks, here's how to super chill your beverages. To super chill your cooler, all you'll need is salt. I'm gonna check the temperature before I add the salt to see if it makes a difference. Now that's cold. Now add the salt. Use a coarse salt, or better yet, ice cream salt. You don't need much, just a generous sprinkle over the top. That was way generous. Now get in there and mix it up. Now that the drinks are in there, just let them get extra frosty. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah, it's much colder. All it took was a little science to get these drinks extra cold. As things heat up out there, make sure you're staying super cool. Thanks for watching Problem Solved. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and check out some of our other videos like these two right here.